Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is Ubuntu Touch on a Nexus 5. Nexus 5. I'm going to try and install. I'm going to try and install uh, Libertine Kazam which is a screen casting tool. <clears throat> Doing this one-handed, so if I make sloppy errors, it's my, you know, because there's no built-in tool in Ubuntu Touch for creating screen grabs or screen casts. Uh, and while we're at it, uh, Libertine Containers. Normally when you hold down something like that, you get an option for deleting but that's not the case here I'm not even sure how to delete this existing container I go to manage container <clears throat> and it doesn't look like there's any delete so that's another problem but let's go ahead and install a package I think I press the plus button and I'm going to Enter package name or Debian file, and in this case, uh, the Debian file is, I believe it's called Kazam. So let's go ahead and try Kazam. Click OK. <clears throat> and theoretically, it's doing something. I'm not super keen on this UI not giving the option of you know showing the terminal because that would be nice, right? But uh, when you click on View More, it doesn't show the operation. says it's still installing but the operation details says its status is ready but that's not what's happening says it's installing and I chose <coughs> Kazam because it's actually part of the launch pad for Ubuntu. And huh. Yeah, got the same message last time with the other one. No packages are installed, no error message, no nothing. Uh, so that's... That's what I get when I try to use Libertine. No packages installed. Let's try something is that should work How about um okay i didn't download anything so package name let's try g edit since g edit's been around forever click okay And again, I go to view operation details and I don't get any, I don't get any of the terminal information to find out actually if something is happening because it says it's installing, but uh, it's not super informative.
I'm going to pause because clearly it's taking a long time. And again, uh, installation failed. No error message, no feedback on why it failed, just failed. So that's three applications I've tried, two of which you've seen me try to install. Uh, neither of them worked on Ubuntu Touch. On Ubi ports, let me see if it has the details of the install here. No. And there's the about. No. And here is the device, uh, Ubuntu 16.04 OTA 11. Thanks for watching and happy computing.